Good afternoon, my gorgeous crafty friends. How are you all? I am a giddy kipper today. I am so pleased to be back in my own studio. It's been a whirlwind of the last couple of weeks. So if you are tuning in for the first time, this is my amazing studio. And this is a studio that I talk about relentlessly in all of the shows that I do. Create and Craft, HSN, live in here too. My name is Tony Darrick and this is just an incredible place to come and get your inspiration. Maybe you've lost your mojo, maybe you're a brand new crafter, maybe you're a, a seasoned crafter and just need to come and have a chat with some of our lovely, lovely friends. We have a beautiful family on the How To Craft Network, on the Eureka fan page and also on our website as well. You need to check the ladies out on there. Please stay connected, whatever you're doing, because you just never know. Somebody might live down that road and you just don't know about it so if you are watching on youtube please click that subscribe button this lets me know if i'm doing okay it gives us a wider reach and also it allows you to get the notifications when we are live which is most days although i haven't been live for quite it feels like years <laughs> but it hasn't actually been years. Um, but we are live most days, and if it's not me, it is some beautiful other faces from our lovely guest presenters as well. I have a lovely show lined up for you today, albeit I just want to talk today. I'm bouncing around a bit. I'm still coming down from HSN in America. Um, I am giving a big shout out to all of our USA fans who are now on as well saying hello. So let me know whereabouts in the world you're all from because I know we all like to connect and I know a lot of you talk amongst yourselves as well. And wouldn't, wouldn't it be fabulous if we um, were talking to some of our lovely friends across the pond as well. Let's stay connected, craft. Let's share the love of craft. Let's do it always. Let's keep it real, guys. Let's keep it real. So in today's studio, I have a bit of an eclectic mix today. It is a bit of painting. It's got a bit of sparkle. But equally, I've put some really affordable goodies on today. Now, if you have what's in the show, which probably half of you have got everything on the counter, because I know exactly what you're all like, that's absolutely fine. Maybe I'll be able to inspire you when we get over to the demo desk. I have a couple of things to talk about, some updates. I've seen some of you asking some questions on the Eureka fan page. I have some solid updates for you today as well, which is brilliant, because it can put some of that uncertainty to bed and we can move forward. So shall we? Have a little shout out. I'll do one quick shout out because you're all quickly talking to me. I'm so excited to see you all. Thank you so much. So hello, Pat. Hi, Sue. Hi, Samantha. Hi, Jan. Hi, Michaela. Hi, Linda. Hi, Roxanne. Hi, Karen. Hi, Enid. Hi, Jackie. Hi, Kay. And then let's jump on to our um, social media platforms across Facebook too. So hi, Paula. Hi, Leslie. Hi, Linda. Hi, Marilyn. It's just moving too, too quickly. I will come and have a proper talk to you when I get to the other side. Now, if you are brand new to our channel, we do the counter, then we go to the other side and we just ask questions and have fun and be creative with the popular products that we have here at Stamps By Me. Let's have a look at item number one on our counter. I'm going to be quite quick today, ladies and gents, um, because I want to get to the other side. Now, item one on the counter. Now, Carly launched these in our brand event, 100345, 15.99, 15.19 if you are in the club, and they are in a magical watercolour set that has a brush, a pencil, and a whole host of lovely, lovely colours. Now, the Maya and Himmy that we bring to you here in the How To Craft Network studio is an incredible range at a super affordable price. Now, don't be put off by the price thinking they're not going to be great. Trust me when I tell you we've been housing Maya and Himmy for over two years. They are an incredible brand. We just cannot keep it in stock. They are fabulous. Brilliant for giftables, but equally, if you are starting out as a colourist, it's a great starting point and you have everything you need in that kit. 100345. I am literally going so fast because I want to get over there. I've got my coffee over there as well. So the next item on the counter, well, the next two items on our counter are our amazing invisible ink pads. Now, we launched these a couple of weeks on Create and Craft. They absolutely few. I have a handful myself, but as you know, they go to TV most times unless I'm ex launching something exclusive here in our own studio. So what we have is what we have, 100386. Now, these are your five by sevens, okay? And here are the designs on the reverse. And if you're not au fait with our invisible ink pads, they have a sepia tone, which has a gradient of three colours. All you need to do is add the colour on top and you'll end up with results like this. I will show you in detail these pads when we get to the other side because I am going to paint today. I'm going to get right back to where I started and enjoy 
my painting. You just add that colour on top. They are simply, simply stunning. Make you look like an instant artist. 100386. Club members 329. If you have accrued those points and you get that extra 20% off, £11. Brilliant. Next item on the counter. This is a little bit different. So this one... If you look at the imagery on here, it has a white background. So you can add your stencils, overlays, your splats, whatever you want to do, you can be really creative. I'm not saying you can't be creative with the next one, but let me show you how they're formatted. So they're onto like a vintage sort of toned paper in the background. Can we see those ones there? They're absolutely beautiful. Now, if you're not the best at creating that halo around your artwork, then this does that for you. It takes that fear factor out of it for you. 100387, 1329 in the club. Five by seven in size again. Let me just show you some of the fabulous, fabulous finish. Now, remember, you're just going to paint that colour over that sepia tone and get these beautiful... I mean, come on, nobody knows there was a guide under there. Do we have to tell anybody? We absolutely do not. Enjoy the process. Be proud of your artwork. Paint over those tones. Oh, you're all wanting to say hello. There's just another one there where we've painted around with a sparkly pen. So you get the idea. You're all wanting to say hello. I get to the other side. I promise you I will get to the other side and we'll have a lovely catch up. I have had my flapjack and I'm ready to have that cup of coffee. So I'm ready to literally fill my boots with questions and answers and creativity. And did you see my Facebook Live this morning? I was bouncing. Doesn't take much for me. So let's have a look at the items fourth, fifth and sixth on the counter. Now, you don't get them all. It's a choice of. So your first row is your choice of your clear sparkles. Now, these are stickles. They are a brand of glitter glue, which I find all the time and use quite often. And they give you that lovely sparkly overlay over your projects. We'll use these today just in case no one's ever heard of these. I'm sure lots of you have. 100, my apologies, we've got pink on the counter there. Do we have, could we have the clear one, please, if it's possible? So I'll just talk you through the colours while we just sort that one out for you. Regardless of that, the price is the same. 11.39 if you are in the club and for this first collection you get these lovely clear sparkles now you get one with a gold undertone thank you so much blue undertone green undertone a crystal clear some with a touch of purple and some with a touch of neon blue 100390 now make a note of the item numbers if you wish if you are watching me on catch up right now these are about to sell out. However, I do encourage you to check um, later. Sometimes things bounce out of people's baskets. 100390. They're normally three pounds each. So I'll let you do the maths. So that's your clear collection. And if I just tilt them, if I could tilt them, can we see? That? Yeah, you can see the color there. They are all different, I promise you. They all give you a sort of different look underneath your artwork. Love these ones. So that was the clear one. Move this one out of the way. Then we're going to move on to the pink collection, which we've got some lovely tones of red and fuchsia in there as well. 100388, 1139. Okay, so we get this sort of psychedelic pinks. Emma would love these, wouldn't she, on my team? They are different. So you get two tones of pink. We get sort of two tones of a red, so brilliant for Christmas as well. And then we get this lovely fuchsia fuchsia colour here. Now, they're all incredibly beautiful. How are you going to decide? I have no idea, but that is your pink collection. 100388 if you are in the club. So moving forwards, I'll just push these forward just a little bit. And then these are your blue. I would say it is a blue collection, but there is some steely colours and some teal. We all love a good steel and teal. So we have like a, that is definitely a teal. Then we have your sort of traditional blue. Then we have your green Really pretty. This one has a touch of gold. This is actually a mix. This is one of my all-time favourites. This one and the clear ones. And then we have this one which has that blue undertone. Really, really pretty. If you are a collector of these and don't have all of the colours, the price is so affordable. 11 39 in the club. And again, if you have those discounts of 10 5 10 15 20 because you've accrued the points because you have been purchasing from us here, then you're going to see the discounts. I do say pop them in your basket, have a look at the discounts. If you're happy, check out. If you're not, empty it out. Don't leave it sat there. 100389, so that's that collection there. Moving down the counter then, we have three more items. Very quickly, we have these three um, A5 sort of, um, sort of um, nesting dice, should we say. So they are a nesting die with a difference. They're not all the same shape. So you have your solid outline, then the next one down is a detailed, then a solid, then a detailed. And these have the 
elements that pop out the butterflies on this one so this is your butterfly stitch this is your square shapes and at the base there you can see the word enjoy that is a die cut and then you get the coordinating outline then at the base we have great and this one has that cinch detail with a sort of like um, clover design in there great for gents cards this one this one is my favorite out of all of the ones that we created this has the word great, so you get the mat and layer, the word great and the mat and layer, cinch detail on there. And again, you can see the straight edge. Then the next one down is a detailed and so on and so forth. And then we have congrats, which is this beautiful one here, which is your star aperture. And again, so on and so forth, design goes down. Then you get the word congrats with that mat and layer. They are big, they are big, big squares. So this one is 100391. 53.97 HTCN 29.99 if you're not in the club you can join our club it's 15 pounds for the year which means you get all of those discounts throughout the year you're entitled to join our sales and our clubs and our goodie bags and all of the good stuff that we do here on the how to craft network but if you are in the club 28.49 if you are not in the club and you're accruing those points you will get those discounts and if you are the top end of the points you will be getting free postage as well so it's you know the more you spend the more you get back from us here at stamps by me and that's just to say you know thank you for supporting us one zero zero three nine two moving down moving down so we have these two here now these sold through last time we had them to wear they're both together today so we have the cheshire plate and alice cover plate we've ordered these back in these will be going back to tv today 23.74 they're normally 17.99 each one zero zero three nine two this is a great starter kit if you like the cover plates that we do here at stamps by me now when they go to telly they will not be this price so if you've been sitting on the fence thinking oh, i lost them last time now's the time to get them because they will be going to tv in about a month's time when i have a show allocated one zero zero three nine two last one on the counter which is our lamination stamp now this is one that hasn't even been to tv i don't believe has it been to tv oh i can smell the wood burning i don't believe it has correct me if i'm wrong but um this was one that we just did as an exclusive design and it has that rose corner and that beautiful sort of bud design on there i know we've had it in studio here i can't remember if it's been to tv e even so it's called all the best item number 100397 traditionally all of our stamps are 17.99 and today in the club, 14.24. So I've, I've knocked a few pounds off that one for you there. So if you want to try lamination for the first time, great starting point. I know if our HSN and our American followers are watching and loved the lamination stamps that were on there, this is another addition to the lamination family. So let's have a look, okay? Everybody's good. So let's move down the counter onto my demonstration counter. Let's say hello to our friends. I hope you're all well. Is everybody okay? I hope so. Let's have a look. So, um, uh, have we got sound on Facebook? Sorry to throw it in the mix there. We'll just have a look for you, ladies and gents. Yep, it looks like we have. Hopefully, it sorted itself out for you there, Tina, Glynis, Kim. Lovely to see you all. Let's have a look on another. I've got so many screens. It's like being in a call centre. <laughs> So let's say hello on the other platform. So Linda, Linda Page, question, question. I won your two cards and stamps. Can you tell me what the lovely smooth colored card stock is, please? Do you sell it? Linda, I have slept since then. Which cards were they and what stamps were they? Maybe I can help that way. Question, question. Are the gossip pens coming back in stock, Samantha? Is it the Gossip Alcohol Markers or is it the Gossip Sparkle Watercolour Inks? Let me know. <laughs> oh, so, hi Brian, hi Adele, hi Pauline, hi Bernadette, hi Teresa, hi Marilyn, hi Shirley, hi David, hi Carol Ann. Let me know where are we all watching from and what's the weather like? I tell you, the rain is not a good sketch here in sunny Wakefield. Um, Oh my gosh, there's loads of you on today. I, bet, I better be professional today, sort, sort myself out. Too many on. Right, shall we have some fun? I thought we'd use the invisible ink, the one with the vintage sort of cards in there, because I just love it. 
I just love it and I know a lot of you might have this at home so maybe you might want to paint along if you have them at home so the item number for this one is 100389 make a note of the item code um, check out your baskets if you have them in your baskets as well question question both types of pens so the sparkle one should be there um, Samantha but I'm the gossip alcohol sets are on there but we're limited in what collections we have some of the six sets left and we have some of the 12 don't think we have the full collection in a box available unfortunately you'll have to have a look if you just pop gossip into the top of our website it should take you to all of those pro products beautiful in dorset tony oh jan that cheers me up um melton mowbray i love a pork pie chris chris christine huddleston Melton Mowbray. I passed Melton Mowbray to get to TV. Jan Riley. Hi, Tony. I'm from Spain and the weather is awful today. Rain, rain, rain. Oh, no, that's not good. Miserable here in Kent. So, Karen Austin, now that you're on HSM, will you restock some of, our old, some of your old stamps? I'm thinking of a special date, Karen. Yes, we will be bringing more to you, hopefully in a matter of weeks, months. I'm going to be, I'm coming back. They're letting me come back. So hopefully I'll be able to bring you more creative designs. I will be bringing some of our earlier designs as well. Um, let's have a look. So show, Sunny in Wiltshire, daffodils are out. I've got daffodils in my garden. What Tom planted quite a long time ago. So shall we crack on? Is everyone good though? Everyone's good. You haven't all missed me. Have you all missed me? Did you see that silent pause? Like, as if to say, is any, are you all going to start waving at me? <laughs> Honestly, I need more coffee. So um, next week, I am back on the channel in here, and I'm going to be doing some painting and things with all of the products that we sold on HSN. Now, all of the products that we sold on HSN, you have bought in the UK. You haven't missed out. I am not... Um, uh, going to show you anything that you haven't already had or capable of buying okay so check it out uh, i will confirm a date for uh, probably over the weekend and come and get your crafty sash out and maybe craft along it's just to show that little bit of follow-up support for our lovely usa fans who will be probably joining us more often than not now and getting involved with all of the lovely stuff here on the how to craft network everybody's missed me oh my gosh that fills me with joy have all missed me. Tim, Tim, everybody's missed me. <laughs> like hole in Ed. I'm only joking. So, a couple of things to tell you about. I have my list here. I have the winner of the £50 voucher from when we did our craft event day. I know you all enjoyed that craft event day. Oh, let's have a look. Oh, I'm not sure what the question I can see. I don't know what the conversation is about there. Um, Tim will have a look. Um, so I have the winner of the £50 voucher. Couple of things to give you an update on if you want to attend the Port Sunlight Stamping Together Festival. This, the um, tickets are now available on our website. Just put Stamping Together in the website and it brings it up. We have some cool features with the tickets now. So you can go on and purchase a ticket, but say, for instance, you're all, all four of you are getting in a car and just one person wants to buy all of the tickets for all of their friends. All you need to do is go to the website, put the four tickets in, and what it will do is it will ask you for the emails of each, per, each person who's there, so you can email them the ticket if you want to. So if at any point you get separated, one person can't jump in the same car and you're panicking about, you know, um, I've got her ticket and she won't be able to get in and things like that. We've taken that total fear out of it for you. Go in and put email addresses in. Now, if you decide, you know what, I can't be bothered with the emails, I'm just happy to get everybody's ticket, I'll sort it when I get there, then that's absolutely fine. But if your circumstances change and you want to put in an email address, you can go back a day later, a week later, a month later. Just add that email address and it'll just get sent straight away, okay? We've got some super cool features. I don't want anybody to have to worry about tickets, emails, e-tickets. We've made it so, so easy for you. And then you'll just get an email confirmation, which is your ticket. So please don't 
let it frustrate you if you're struggling with it you can always contact us but we have made it as simple it simple as it can possibly be to take the frustration out of it so if you want to tell all of your crafty friends it's the 2nd of april the tickets are four pounds and if you want to come and say hello come and say hi to me and the team then you can do that we've got some fabulous stands exhibiting at the show as well that is the 2nd of april what have i got to tell you next TV, short notice TV, I'm back on TV on Monday. I must have done something right, they've asked me to come back. <laughs> so I have, uh, I think it's called a one day special. One day special, the hours are different for a one day special now, it's all changed and it's like going to school for the first time. So this one is a 4 p.m. and 8 p.m. of an evening on Monday. It's all new to me too, hope you can tune in. And then 8 a.m. in the morning. So I get three live hours uh, showcasing some products, uh, some new bundles and things like that. It isn't brand new, but it is some um, bundles that I've put together so it makes it a little bit different. So if you want to come and tune in for the inspiration, that would be appreciated. It was so scary at TV yesterday, I cannot tell you. But equally, it was amazing as well. You know, change is as good as a rest and we need to get in, get in with it and get on with it and just enjoy the love of craft. Who cares if a set isn't great? I know a lot of you have been commenting about sets and things like that. Who cares if a set isn't great? It's what's going on on this overhead camera right now, okay? So let's just be patient with what's going on and just share the love of craft. Enjoy the love of craft. And most of all, if you've got a smile on your face, it makes me very happy. And if I've got a smile on my face, then we're, we're doing something right, aren't we? Let's have a look. Um, just bear in mind as well, when you do buy your tickets, you don't get your points on your tickets, your £4, because basically we'd be giving you them for free. And we can't afford to do that. We give everything else away for free, but not tickets. <laughs> and then, Create Together Club, our stamp, your second stamp. Thank you so much, everybody, for your patience. I cannot thank you enough. It's getting sent next week, thankfully. And then what I'll do is, I'll wait till you've all got them, and then I'll dedicate a week of inspiration, as promised, with that programme. So if you want to get involved with that, all you need to do is put Create Together in the search engine. And it's three stamps for the year. And the second one is due next week. It's a little bit late. Well, I'll say a little bit. It feels like a year. But it is a little bit late. And then you've got the third one throughout the end of the year as well. And what we do is we craft together for a week. And I show you different ways of using um, that particular stamp and it's a total surprise if you buy it now you will get the first stamp that was launched at the beginning of the year which was like that typewriter one um, and all the videos are there for the full week of me using that typewriter so it doesn't matter if you buy the first or at the second point or at the last point you're going to get all of the stamps because it's part of a collection okay so my gosh you are all asking me some questions today right Right, so Sue Dernall, question. Do, the, do you do pastel colouring pencils? We do. They are the Himmy and Maya ones. If you pop oil pastel pencils or oil into the search engine, keep it really simple, they will come up there in a orange packaging for you. They are amazing. Second question. When will the blending brushes be back in stock? Uh, they are on order. Um, I don't know. I cannot give you a clear date on that one. But as soon as they do land, I will let you know. Valerie, it's overcast in East Sussex. Donna, um, Donna's overrun on her live on the Pearly Winks page. <laughs> Thank you for joining me, Donna. Cutting your short to get here today. Right, so any more questions before I move on? I need, a, I need some coffee. I feel like all I'm doing is talking. My gosh, have I missed you all. Mm, Carol Ann said, Matt showed us a studio. Carol Ann, I don't know if you saw my message on Facebook, but thank you so much for your beautiful embroidered frame and card as well. Absolutely amazing. Thank you so much. Right. Are we okay? Shall we crack on? Let's crack on. Let's craft. Ooh. It's all turned into a haze. Let's be creative. So I'm going to, let's have show you this invisible ink. So when you get it home, you have the images across the back, okay? And you get six designs and they come like this. So this is probably the best example here. So you get that lovely sepia tone, which is underneath. And all you literally have to do is add the colour on top. And the design pushes through 
the shading absolutely pushes through giving you the most incredible pieces of artwork okay little to no effort these really are going to help you out with your watercoloring because it's getting you into the habit of picking up that brush which is this one here or any brush and painting and this is going to get your um, muscle memory going with your wrist and you're going to just be practicing without even knowing about it as well so there are several designs six let's have a look let's see them and then you get this sort of like corner design here which is so so gorgeous black washi tape uh, joanne the black washi tapes i haven't ordered them yet i have ordered them twice and they've sold out um i'm they will probably be ordered when our Christmas washi tape comes because we've got some Christmas washi tape as well. So, we've got lots of exciting stuff happening. So, let's get straight. I'm going to do oranges because normally I do florals. Today, I'm going to do the oranges. Now, let me just show you a couple of these samples here, guys. So, I think all of the... Let's just sort this out here. I think all of the stickles uh, collections have gone. So, if you have them in your basket... Uh, I'm not going to say you're going to take the risk of losing them because I hate to push you to buy them but I will have to remove them if they're still in baskets about half an hour or an hour after the show okay so make sure you check out your baskets if you really want them um, if you um, like anything else over the weekend and you want to add it to your order you simply can do that just click add to previous order uh, and don't pay postage again So Latricia has a big smile on her face and in her heart. Oh, Latricia, thank you so much. Christmas? Oh, no. I know. I'm sorry. So, but my Christmas collection this year is um, smaller this year because I felt like last year's was that amazing that I've brought some of it back this year. Like the baubles, the pine cones, they were just amazing and i absolutely adore them so i've brought those back i've ordered some more of those and we've added some complementing elements as well so not a big collection this year but still equally as gorgeous let's have a look here so let's let's get some crafting done so all i'm going to do is i'm going to follow the guide on the back of my paper pad here can you see there's like a little guide let me just show you um some other samples as well so this is just basically that color laid onto that overlay why not incorporate it in with your stamps this is one that sharon's done create your own opportunities you would never know that that guide is underneath to create these beautiful masterpieces they are so so beautiful i cannot tell you how incredible they are thank you tony ordered 100393 thank you carol the girls are still in, so they might get it out of the door for you. Fingers crossed, hey. So let's get straight on to our crafting. I'll just bring this back. So I'm going to go into this orange here. So we've got some people shouting out on Facebook. Hi, Louise. Hi, Simon. So I'm going to follow this guide here. Let's mix up some green. And I'll show you how simple it is. Very, very simple. I have the winner of oh, I have the winner of the voucher, and I'll announce that at the end, so you're all going to stay tuned, so <laughs> I don't bore you. And then um, our next brand event is on the eighth of April. You need to save that day. Full day of craft. So it was such a success last week. Uh, guess what? We're going to do it again. We're going to change it up a little bit because as we're learning, we're going to change it up a little bit but it's a full day of craft. So, so if, you refre if you are shopping on the website and can't see the product, just refresh your browser. All of the items will pop up there now for you. So you can see the watercolor inks, the papers, the stickles. You can see me there talking, 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 putting the world to rights. There we go. So let's do some painting. So I've got this green, I've diluted it down. gorgeous samples from the design team aren't they just so i'm just going to take this green and paint over this leaf and what will happen is the light and shade underneath will push through and give me the detail so one shade of green here ladies and gents 
so I don't have to worry about mixing a darker green. Get that colour on. Now, after time, what I've found a lot of you have started to do is you do it once and then you all start to um, be a little bit more creative and start to add that light and shade, which fills me with joy because that is what the pad is there to do. You'll do it the first time, like step by step as it is on the book. But the second time you'll be like, you know what, I might add that where it's darker here, I might actually go in myself and add a, sh a darker shade of green just to make it even more prominent. You don't have to, but you may do, which again is pushing your boundaries with your painting. So have the courage to sort of um, give it a go, at the very least give it a go. And you will not get this sort of thing anywhere in the world. I have done my, re before I even brought this to market, I did have a good old look around to see if anybody's done anything like this in the world. And I cannot see anything and I still cannot see, well, that'll change soon, I'm sure. <laughs> However, at this moment in time, this is totally unique to stamps by me. Totally unique. You cannot get anything like this anywhere else. Quite confident when I say that. Now you're all going to go, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> So let's just add, I'm just colouring in those green leaves. And you can see, I mean, look at this. I'm already proud of my work. I haven't done anything. Don't tell anybody you haven't done anything though. Hey, come on. So Anne's asking a question, question. Can anyone tell me how I get to order my goodies? Cannot find where I can place an order. Thank you. So Anne, are you on the How to Craft Network website or are you on the Stamps by Me website? Let's, let's help you out here. Which website are you on, sweetheart? If you're on the How to Craft Network, the products, when you open the website browser, the products are there below me talking. You'll see me talking at the top, scroll down, all of the products are there. Okay. There is also at the side of me talking a button that says shop the show. And that will take you to everything I've put in this specific show. So you haven't got to go hunting. It's literally attached to this show. Question, question from Samantha. Samantha says, do we have a list of exhibitors for the show? I do, Samantha. I'm just waiting on the last two to confirm before I pop it out. I learned a lot of lessons last year. Um, I don't know if you noticed, but I post the exhibited list two or three times and people obviously cancelled and then said they were doing it and then they weren't doing it and things like that. So I do not post it until I'm absolutely certain all of my exhibitors have, have confirmed. I'm hoping that this will be the case early next week. As soon as it, I've got it through, I'll definitely post it for you. I just don't want to let anybody down because last year I put stands on there that initially said they would do it. And then people came saying, it said on the exhibitors list that such and such. I was like, yeah, but I updated it two or three times after when they cancelled. And I think it caused a little bit of frustration. And as you know, I hate to frustrate. So, um, as soon as absolutely confirmed, obviously I cannot be um, certain that nobody else will cancel or want to do the show or something like that. But as long as I've got everybody confirmed, I'll get it out to you. Hi, Marie. Hi, Roxy. So I've just painted those green leaves. What do I think so far? Do I look better than I actually am? Of course I do. I look amazing, don't I? <laughs> Who wouldn't? So let's just colour these green leaves here. I could use um, some green on some leaves and some on the others. Looking good, that. Oh, Samantha says, fantastic year last year. It was, it was brilliant, wasn't it? This year's just going to be as good, though, I promise. So if you are watching the show right now, can you see a share button anywhere? Can you see a share button on YouTube? Can you see a share button on Facebook? Wherever you're watching, if you could share, that would be amazing. Get some more subscribers onto our channel. Get more people to watch the shows. Get involved. So I'm just literally following the guide underneath. I'm not sure if these are sprigs or leaves. But equally, I'm just following the guide underneath. I'll tell you, if you like mindful craft, 
you are going to absolutely love these just it's like painting by numbers it's so so cool so i'm just going to follow i think that'd be green what's these here what's these they're green let's get a, let's add a bit of different tone of green in here shall we just to mix it up a little bit so is it green yeah so i'm just going to drag that color out Follow that guide underneath. Some of them are actually like white open spaces, which is quite cool. So let's bring this green into here. Looking good, isn't it? Excuse me, let me just turn off this heater. It's getting rather hot because I'm concentrating. Enid, question, question, are you doing it again, Tony? Are you referring to um, stamping together, Enid? Is that what you're referring to, sweetheart? Because if that is the case, yes, I will be. If I didn't do it, there wouldn't be a show, sweetheart. <laughs> Come on, Enid, get with programme. <laughs> I better be careful what I say to Enid. She literally does live around the corner. She could quite easily come storm in here and get me. God, could you imagine? That would be fun, wouldn't it? Now, it's sort of... I'm just filling in these spaces here. Where it looks like it's green. And then you can see you've got some white flowers that just pop there from the centre. That is looking quite cool, what do we say? So, <laughs> so let's, shall we do these lovely um, oranges? Could you get away with them being tomatoes? Could you paint them like tomatoes if you wanted to? Maybe? Pop a bit of red in there. I'm trying to, trying to be a bit like the picture, so I'll add a bit of red maybe. So, let's go for it. So, one layer. How's that looking? I'm happy with that. One layer down. And you can spend as much or as little time as you want on these, you literally can. So I'm just going to get the one layer down first, maybe. Shall we just do that first? Yeah, let it settle, let the ink dry. Then shall we go back over? And I can see from this guide on the back of my um, book here that one of them's got like a bit of green on it. So I'm going to do the green, drop the green in where the image shows a bit of green which is just up here, if you can, I don't know if you can see that there, but it's got a touch of green in there. So I'll pick some of that green up, add some green up here, like so. Yeah, we've done that. So just give it a little bit of contrast and then a bit of green on this. <sighs> Sorry, I've put green up wrong one because my artwork's upside down. So let's pop a little bit on this side as well. You can see the shading here underneath. It's not complicated, it's really not. Keep it simple. And then this one looks like it's got a little bit more red in it at the base, so let's just pop a bit more red into this orange here. What we're thinking, that looks quite good, that, doesn't it? I'm quite pleased with that. So you can see how your shadings come through here. But equally, as time goes by, you'll probably find, like I'm doing here, is you're just adding a little shade of colour just to make it accent like it is on there. So I'm going to just go in and add a little bit more maybe red. Can you see how we've got this, like, halo of shading here? I am just going to go with it and just put it on, like so. And then what I like to do then is I take the water out of my brush and then I just follow it round. 
Can you see that there? Because less water on your project really does help. So just alleviate some of that water a little bit. And let the artwork do the talking. I'm quite happy with that one. So if I wanted to enhance it a little bit, oh, let's just get this um, flower in here. If you wanted to enhance it a little bit more, of course you can do that. You can spend hours on this, but literally how quick was that? It took me, what, 10 minutes max? Right, I'm going to go in now and show you how maybe if you want to elevate the design a little bit further, you absolutely can. So I can see here on this leaf, although it's beautiful and that would be a finished masterpiece, we can work on making it improve it a little bit better so let's just add the darker can we see here so add the green where just where it is on the um leaves itself following the guide and then can we see there so you've added that sort of texture and then take the water out of your brush probably do it with a tissue and just pull it back out See there, so I've got that lovely halo here, it'll dry. And the card is such where it's going to take a while to dry on there. Look at that. So you can see the difference between here and up here. Let's just turn our artwork around a little bit. Let's add a bit on here. So I'm still within my comfort zone. I'm following the shade which is under, but equally if you want to leave it, of course, you can absolutely leave it. But I will you will probably find that after your first and second go, you will keep layer building and layer building and layer building. So let's add some splats on here. So some of the colour that we've got in here. Some of that green. Now there are some actually some white flowers on here which could probably do with a touch of blue just to bring them to life. I will do that in a second. So a bit of orange as well. Like so. And then silly little things that are going to help you elevate your design a little bit. Let's just dry this one off just one second. Uh, Tim. The paper pad's showing 14 99 Would you be able to just change that? If you've been overcharged, don't worry. The girls will refund you the difference. The price just hasn't been changed, that's all. That's my fault, actually. I can't blame anybody because I put them on. trying to laugh you know there's no secrets is there right let me just um show you a couple of little tips and things like that so now for instance if you wanted to like really create a masterpiece you can get your oil pastel pencils in fact let me just see if mine are in here you can get your pastel pencils or your alcohol markers or whatever it is you have in your stash i don't have them oh i know why i haven't got them to hand because tom's had them he used them for a school project. It's fine. So get your pastel pencils or the pens that you have in your stash that you love and you can absolutely enhance the design by going on and just elevating if you want to. Remember, the book is a guide. You are the artist. You add the colour. Right, let's just work on this one here. Just playing here. I'm, fo I'm still following my guide underneath. Can you see now how I've absolutely made this one pop from the page? Can we see that there? And these, are, sorry, I think these are the pencils that somebody was asking about. They are on the website. They are stunning. They blend together beautifully. They are a pastel, but in a pencil format. So you can see there how you sort of like enhanced, brought it to life, really, really go to town. There's a little rivet in there isn't there so let's bring that to life can we see that there and then what you can do is if you have like a gel pen a white gel pen you can go in and add accents highlights dots and things like that if you want to add a halo or a shade or something like that on the on the leaves you can add a line what it'll do is it'll push it back a little bit if you want to you could add a 
really just have fun with the creative designs that's what they are absolutely there for and if you wanted to add splats I'm just going to grab very quickly a sentiment for this and then what I'm going to show you is I'm going to show you how awesome that stickles is. Yeah, I think I don't think I've met one single person who has not been happy with these pencils, with those um, pencils. They are incredible. So I like to stamp my sentiments through my artwork here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give this away. All you need to do is comment underneath this video, as always. I know it's not a £50 voucher today, <laughs> but equally it is a um, nice piece of artwork that I've done for you here today. So the price has been changed on the pads. You've probably been overcharged by a pound. I do apologise. I will get it back to you, though. I won't leave the country, I promise. I promise, she says. <laughs> Let's get this stamped onto here, look. I mean, it could do with, I mean, it should really enhance them all. I'd go on with all of my pens and pencils, probably. But um, time permitting, isn't it? Let's just stamp that one more time. And Michaela's saying the watercolour pencils are very good. They're all really good. I am so pleased I um, am one of the distributors for that company because their product is simply amazing. And it's so affordable, so affordable. They've just brought out some alcohol markers as well, which, you know, I have my own alcohol markers. Do I need any more? Absolutely not, but they are so yummy to look at. They are amazing. Like, um, on a Monday, we have something called craft therapy where a lot of customers come and play with the goodies. And there's a lady who comes, I don't even know if she's on, she might be on, she's on most days, Amanda. And we're both like, do we need another set of watercolours? Yeah. <laughs> do we need another set of pens? Yeah, but don't tell our other halves. <laughs> pens and pencils, my gosh. Lots and lots. So let's just show you how we can make these sparkly. Samantha, right. Good question, Samantha. Um, Samantha, question. Do you know when the next set of tools, glass mat, uh, accessories will arrive? Need to prepare my craft room and my husband. Right, so here's the deal with this, Samantha. Now, my partner is in the room and he'll probably kick my butt for telling you this. But as you all know, it's all over social media. We have just come from a transition from Create and Craft to the craft store. One from the other. Unfortunately, we didn't get paid from one. We have moved to the other one and it's absolutely fine. The new craft store is amazing. They're looking after us amazingly. However, the money that was owed from the other craft store, we didn't get and it was a lot. So unfortunately, that's put a little bit of a hold on some of the projects that we were going to do. We're still going to do the projects. But it's just going to take a little bit longer, OK, just to get just to get through that little bit of a sticky process. Just be reassured, though, that at the new craft store, everything is fine. They're looking after us fabulously. But we've just got that little bit of a lull. Just need to get over a little bit and we'll be absolutely fine. So things are going to be a little bit longer, but equally, they are still coming. Um, so I do appreciate your patience on that one. It's a difficult time. But we're good, we're good. So let's just show you this lovely stickles. So on this one, I'm using Icicle. I don't, are these, I don't know if there's these left. Anyway, that paper pad, 100387. I'm being told this is sold out. So I'm going to use it anyway, because some of you have probably got it at home and would like to see. So tap, tap, tap. And then all you do is you pop it on. And with the clear ones, the colour underneath does shine through not putting a lot on I just like it a subtle I'll do a few and then I'll hold it up for you so shall we pop a little bit on the orange as well so you can see what I mean when I say it shines the color underneath shines through and the sparkle sort of it disperses but it's a beautiful sparkle Just do a few more. I'm being very light here because I don't want a big blob on. But um, just 
Just one second, I feel like I'm just getting the glue through there and I want some sparkle as well. Try now. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Crikey. One extreme to the other. Let me just drag some of that sparkle onto these ones now. In fact, I'll take that off because that was just glue. There we go. Um, I'm not sure. I Shall I do? I'll just do a few more just so you get the idea. But equally, these are the ones that show the colour through. The red ones are brilliant for your red berries and things like that. And then the, the blue ones have those steely colours and your graphite colours, which look incredible on black card. So it's personal preference. I'm not sure. I don't think there's many left, to be honest with you. Let me just hold this up and just show you. Is that okay? Hopefully you'll be able to catch that sparkle. Yeah, Charlotte, I'm living on beans, bread and jam. I'm all right, though. I don't care. I've still got my craft. <laughs> I've still got my paints. I don't really <laughs> care about food. <laughs> oh, there we go. So when it dries back, the shininess sort of disperses and you're just left with sort of a glitter effect on there. It's quite cool. So there we go. I think I like that. Do you like that? What I'm going to do is I'm going to give this one away. All you need to do is pop a comment underneath this live video get that interaction have a chat amongst yourselves let me know what your thoughts are on the show uh, what have i missed is tony moving enid i'm not moving i'm still with create and craft just a different building absolutely gorgeous thank you donna that's super kind so a couple of things remember save the date we have the 8th of april for our next brand event 2nd of april stamping together parts unlike tickets are now available we've got some new stands on that one as well all to be announced next week your create together club is with us this week sent out as well um and the winner of the 50 pound voucher from last show is adele dunn adele dunn you've won the 50 pound voucher of those lovely uh, so you can spend on our website enjoy so whatever you're doing, have a lovely afternoon, stroke evening. Don't forget, though, I am on the Craft Store short, short notice show Monday, 4, 8, and 8 a.m. on Tuesday. I think it's called a one-day special. Don't hold me to that. It's like a new day at school. Take care, everyone. Bye.